So I think my take-home message is that um, you're doing a very brave, very great job. Uh, Child Protection Social Workers are really on the front line, you're the front line advocates. Um, and I don't think you must lose hope. I think you, you need to, often we look at what's wrong and not at what's strong. And in South Africa, we live in a culture of, of high stress and high vulnerability. So I often look at acronyms so that you can remember um, four things you can do. So I want you to remember the acronym STOP. So S is for services or support. Remember that if we need to support these children who are in dangerous situations, we need to ensure their safety and we need to try and ensure their basic needs. The T is for treatment. Remember treatment is mandatory um, because the consequences are lifelong. Treatment is mandatory and we need to give these child victims an opportunity to recover. O is for outcome. Don't always see the now, see the bigger picture. Um, and we might not always be able to change the situation the child's in now, but we want to allow the child hope to strengthen their ability to be able to recover long term. And more than that, read. Read about research, read about evidence-based research and try all you can to try and inform policy making and policies um, discussions. And then the P is for prevention. If you can do one thing, look at an effective program. It doesn't need to look, you don't need to look at quality, I mean quantity, but you must just look at quality, even if it is one message that you can take home to children. So look at effective prevention. Overall, my message today is remember that it's easier to build and strengthen healthy children than to rehabilitate a society of injured adults.